good guys what is good we are back new vlog for those of you who are new my name is christina and um for those of you returning i live in london right now but i'm currently in edinburgh so matilda and i just checked in it's been quite the journey to get here she just came from canada today Such a long trip from Toronto yes yeah, it's been quite <laughs> quite a long trip and then I met her at the airport and now we are fast forwarded and checked in to the Eden Lock in Edinburgh so this is both of our first times here and we're pretty excited the Sun is out which is so unlike London and um, I'm gonna show you guys our room because it is very very cute all right so you walk in and we have our bed which is nice here's my travel outfit obviously didn't really try today Really cute. It's like a room divider, but it's also the closet, which I think is awesome. Oh my god, this is so nice. Oh, love this. Yes. And then we come into the living area. We have this couch where Kira will sleep for two days. Um, <laughs> we honestly, yeah, hopefully they don't catch us. And then we have the kitchen. So this honestly is probably bigger than my apartment in London. <laughs> I'm not even joking. This is so nice. We could do like a cooking tutorial. And then we have our kitchen. Matilda Why wants would to we do a cooking tutorial? Matilda wants to do cheese vacation. and wine. She wants to do a cheese and wine night. I'm like, you mean vegan with vegan cheese and gluten free crackers? Because I don't fucking eat cheese. Well, it makes you feel sick and lethargic. That's the thing. But anyway, we're gonna get changed and go eat. And Matilda's gonna shower and nap for a couple hours. And then we'll show you guys around Edinburgh. Good morning, guys. It is officially day one in Edinburgh. Um, until I just woke up, did her makeup, she's just doing some reading as I finish getting ready because I'm always last. Morning off with hot water and lemon because we have a little kitchen as I showed you yesterday which is so cute and fully equipped. Um, and Matilda's supposed to have an interview today but they moved it so it's sunny outside and we're going to do some exploring. So I'm just going to have this, have some berries and then we're going to get started with our day. I'm not getting this. <laughs> I'm gonna get this. These glasses are kind of cute too. They are really cute. Guys, they came out a new woman. Matilda's gonna be fucking embarrassed to walk around with me. I feel like like a Russian something. Should I take my photo with this too? Yeah, so please. I sent it to Ellie and Parker. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> okay, so we just got to this vegan place called the Lucky Pig, which Matilda scouted for us. And it's like vegan or vegetarian bar food because they have halloumi, so they still have like cheese and stuff. Um, but they have a lot of really good options. And we haven't eaten yet, so. Pretty hungry. What? Wait. <laughs> I forget that you added it. So I'm like, oh my god, I don't know what to say. <laughs> no, just say whatever. Chipotle mac and cheese looks fire. Chipotle cauliflower cheese. Alrighty, so it's way later now and we just kind of took a little rest after lunch. How'd you like lunch? It was really good. Yeah. I loved it. It was pretty good. And what was the place called? Paradise? It's called, yeah, it has two names. It's called the Lucky Pig, but it's now called Paradise Songs. And it's really good for drinks, cocktails at night, mm -hmm. which is, I think it's more of a vibe then because there's like neon lights everywhere and stuff. But we decided to opt for wine here. Look how nice these glasses are. Cheers. cheers. Um, and we're going to a, wait, I should drink this first, but you just cheers. <laughs> mm. It's very warm. Yeah. Okay, I'm afraid. I know, yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Um, yeah, oh my God, I think the heat from the room. Yeah. Like it's heated it up. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, yeah, so we're going to a haunted tour but speaking of coronavirus let's talk about that okay so yesterday we both start <laughs> feeling sick at the airport we both really? started getting like an so itchy throat <laughs> we probably sanitized like 70 times we've been very just careful like our yeah. hands are dry because of how much we sanitized yeah. our hands the world is in a fucked up place right now obviously like we feel like we're in a film. Don't you feel like yeah. you're in a movie? Yeah. About like, like Danielle just called me today and she's like, I feel like we're in a movie. Like everything's falling apart. <laughs> but we're making the most out of it. Um, so it's only our first full day here in Edinburgh. 
we didn't really do that much, but, <laughs> but it's okay. But I'm really excited about this gothic haunted tour. And um, we found a bunch of recommendations for bars and restaurants that we're gonna go to over the next few days. So we'll share that with you guys, but for now. My dad called me when we were at brunch and he's like, hey, like what's up? Oh yeah, so we have relatives in Edinburgh. And we have a famous <laughs> relative Bonnie. named Prince Bonnie <laughs> Charles or something. Um, so he's gonna send me some info and then we can look that up. He thought I was trying to plan to go back to Toronto in April and I was trying to go in May for work. And now he's like, I think you should go back. Like he seriously thought that I should go back. So I don't know what to do. I think he just wants you to be at home. It gets that bad. Okay, quickly just got back in the room and I wanted to show you guys this new sweater that I just got because I was eyeing it. We walked past this men's store just on my street. Um, I think we're on George Street. And I saw it yesterday and I didn't bring a sweater and it's so cozy so I went in and tried it on. It's obviously big but I got in a large and it's really cute I think. Let me see what the back is like. But it's gonna keep me warm today, so that's the most important part because we are going on the hike now. And it's a lot warmer than it was yesterday, so so far, so good. <laughs> wow, right. you really did <laughs> it, your free ritual. So we are on our way finally to <clears throat> what is it called? I keep forgetting. Arthur's seat. Arthur seat. And we just got on a bus to get halfway up here basically because we don't want Matilda to be late for her meeting. Slash, I don't want her to be late for a meeting. <laughs> and our bus driver was super hot. Minus the braid that I didn't see that he had. Also, Kira just joined the crew. <laughs> so we're here now. Kira and Matilda are friends from Western. And I also met Kira through Western as well. Through Matilda. dinner so I'm gonna be moving on to my camera now um, from my or sorry my phone from my camera because we're gonna be going out and having a little bit of fun before Corona gets all fucked and St. Patty's Day is probably not gonna be as hype as we thought it was gonna be um, because I don't know just feels like it might not be um, the best decision to be out in like public bars and stuff with random people throughout this time yeah can't wait to have dinner here. It's called the Scan in the Scally, the restaurant that we're going to. Very, very highly suggested. So I'm sure it'll be delicious and it's more of a traditional take on um, Scottish food. Dessert before poor life. <laughs> looks great on camera. I know, I really do. <laughs> this is basically what we had yesterday. We're back <laughs> and we just had the best, the best yum, brunch. Yum, yum. Very good. <laughs> we all had a egg dish, yeah. I think. Um, so we highly recommend that place. Um, and now we're gonna do some shopping and we're gonna go to the castle. So um, some more adventuring to do today. And a new update on coronavirus. My dad wants me to come home because he thinks that the borders are gonna close in the next like five days. So I have undecided on what I think I should do. It's mostly because my mom thinks like if I'm quarantined and I'm by myself, no one will take care of me if I get sick, but I don't think I'm gonna get sick, so I think we should all be good. So I'll keep you guys updated on that and talk about it later, but. Come on, Corona. <laughs> Let's go get it. Oh, oh that's no. okay. yeah, to be expected. Oh no. <laughs> I don't think the world's gonna end. Guys, we're fucked! That's crazy because at the airport There's I saw so many. 
I didn't look for any. Okay, well, I guess we're screwed. We still have some left. We each have a little bit left. <laughs> we're just gonna use like little, little portion amounts to make it last as long as we need it. Okay, Matilda, let's find the goods. Oh, this is my cellar. Oh, downstairs? The Matilda's certain. Let's have some down. I can't believe they sold out in one day. Oh my god, I love it. <laughs> 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 so so many yesterday, remember? Because I was like, should I buy one? And then I was like, So nah, many? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Eyes were done. back home now we we're a little tired um so we got some wine <laughs> and we don't know what we're gonna eat yet but i don't think we're hungry yet so that's fine um and today we just like traveled around toured around saw the castle but didn't go in because it was like 20 quid to get in we didn't think it was worth it um but matilda picked up this really cool piece of it's print right it's yeah. a print and it's called red door gallery on victoria street so cute yeah, so that's the gallery she got it at, and the gallery she got it at, and the artist who did this, actually, um, is a woman that she interviewed for a project that she's working on. So, I thought that was really cute, and she was actually there, so we got to all meet her, which was nice. And Great, just went to go get our long-awaited food. Look at that. Can you open it? That looks really that good. That looks so... What did you get, Kira? Dun, 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 dun. Mm. Vegan pizza doesn't look so bad. Oh uh, let's go. Can I go? I want oh dipping sauce. Though. I want one of those. It looks so mm. good. That looks oh. good. Take a bite, Matilda. No, <laughs> <laughs> this looks so bomb. Oh, there you go. Good morning, guys. Today is our fourth day, fourth day in Edinburgh. Um, we are checking out of our room today. Kira's leaving today, and we aren't going to a hostel. So we're supposed to check out of this hotel and go into a hostel for like it's St. Patty's, or at least everyone's celebrating St. Patty's today. But we actually decided to not go to the hostel because it's probably high risk of corona, um, or high risk that we'll catch corona <laughs> if we go. So instead we found another room in this place for like super cheap, 111 Canadian dollars. So we're staying here, and I think they lowered the rates because of corona um so our stuff is pretty much all packed up we're going to a fun brunch place called the garden so excited for that but i think i'm gonna go get a croissant and a coffee first because i've been craving a croissant since i got here this is so risky guys how good does this look though so far oh my god this looks like a flying saucer or like <laughs> How the hell do you turn Ew. that on? So it's almost the end of our trip. I am. I have a flight tomorrow morning, and then Matilda comes shortly after. We've been contemplating if she should come at the same time as me, but the flights got so expensive, so ultimately I don't think it makes sense. As you were saying, um, Matilda's gonna come to the airport, and then <laughs> are you gonna come now? <laughs> I literally changed. From we changed. <laughs> We charged my battery for like five minutes and now Matilda's coming through to the airport. Oh, yeah. So we're gonna Uber together and mm -hmm. she's still gonna try and change her flight because she's freaking out. But As I should be, everybody. I mean, like in take, a calm way. Yeah. I think I need to be precautious. Yeah, be cautious. Precautious? Preca I need to take precaution. So we just have to be cautious. And, um. We're gonna watch. Yeah, to ease the mood, I guess. Ease the mood. Mm -hmm. We're gonna watch um, yeah, Legally Blonde. Yeah, we've been Blonde. talking about coronavirus nonstop. <laughs> yeah, it's been like exhausting, but it's on the top of our minds and yeah. and every text message and tweet <laughs> and Instagram post. Um, but yeah, thanks guys for tuning into this video. You'll see more Matilda soon. Last night in Edinburgh, Last night in Edinburgh so and 
we probably won't come back for a long time <laughs> because we we think that you could do Edinburgh in like two and mm-hmm. a half days. Hundred percent. Maybe three if yeah. you go to a distillery or something, <laughs> but definitely two. Yeah. Mm-hmm.